Hey guys, Gina here. So today I'm finally going to be doing an unboxing to the Kanjani 8 puzzle album. Now if you watch my haul of everything I bought in Japan and South Korea, you know that this was one of the albums I bought and the one that I really wanted to buy. Uh, I bought this from Book Off and I paid how much? 695 yen for it, which is pretty reasonable for a Kanjani 8. I think this is a limited edition version album. Um, this is my favorite Kanjani 8 album. Um, my favorite Kanjani 8 song of all time is Roningu Costa and so on along with so many other good quality bops so I just had to buy this album. It was a no-brainer to me. So I just want to do an unboxing with you guys because I haven't opened it yet and I really want to open it. So let's get straight into the unboxing. So um, I think the good thing about Book Off is that you can tell that no one has opened it before you in the shop because of a little paid sign there and also the barcode on it. So I'm just going to be trying to open this here. I probably should have bought some scissors with me. I'm not going to lie, but I didn't because I am dumb. But oh well, who needs nails anyway? Oh my god, I taped this up so well. Guys, what is your favorite kind of Jania album? Let me know in the comments below because I'd be loved. I would be really interested to know. Okay, awesome. So opening the album out of the of course this is second hand um i forgot to mention that book up i have all second hand albums and stuff but that's why it's so reasonable in price okay so first of all the album looks like this it says puzzle kanjane at the front and it has kind of like a puzzle um kind of imprint on the front and you can see all kind of picking picking through in the puzzle there looking very nice and then behind is got kanjane 8 and it has what's on the disc one all the songs in disc two solo collection so solo songs um it has so many good songs on this oh my gosh this is amazing i i love this album i have this album on my phone and i listen to it all the time so let's just go on oh, the sides look like this puzzle kind of eight. so this is of course a sleeve so you you get the cd out from the middle oh my god you've got all the members this looks very early 2000s i guess it was released in the early 2000s wasn't it so you've got all the members looking very nice here. Sitting on a puzzle kind of thing. Oh, and then this is the actual front. They obviously put them the wrong way around. So look at all of them looking so gorgeous. And of course, Subaru is still in Kanji at this time. I did notice that this does a little, have a little crack on it though. I'm not sure if I did this on the way back from Japan in my suitcase because I didn't have much room so I had to squish everything in it. Or if it was um, like the when I bought it for a while. I don't mind. So the thing in this was the making photo book. So I'll just do a quick um, viewing for you guys. So first is the Maru. Looking very nice. I liked when he had longer hair. He looked so handsome. The fashion for this album is a bit questionable, but you know, it's fine. They've got her. Oh my gosh, look at him. He looks gorgeous. That little smile he does. How's the dear he? Okra. Back when Okra only didn't have any ends to his eyebrows, he just had the main part. He looked amazing though. He did look amazing. <gasps> Yasuda! I'm a Yasuda fan by the way, guys. Look at him. Why does he have this weird stuff on it? None of the other members have this weird stuff on it, their page. Oh, well, that's Yasuda for you. Alright, no. Yokoyama does as well. Looks very pretty. Very nice. And of course, Mitakami. Was this from the um, You Can See music video? Because I feel like it was. What do you do with Maru? Because I love that song. It's such a good song. It is. It is. It is. And last one's Maru. So wait, did, is You Can See off this album as well? I feel like it is off this album. But then maybe just not on this disc. Yeah, it's not on this disc. But I feel like it's on the other disc. But I love You Can See. It's one of my favorite um, like, you know, subunit songs from Kanjane. Okay, getting to open the actual album. So... When you open it, oh my gosh, if I can open it, it looks like this. You have the an, another like maybe lyric photo book at the front here. And you have disc one puzzle. There's just a simple DVD. Oh my god, I'm sorry for the glare, by the way, guys. It is just like the, the um, time of the day where the sun like comes right into my face, so I love that. And then this is disc two. Just another plain looking CD. So I'll open the lyric book at the front here for you guys if we can get it out so the front of course looks like this oh this is nice so it's got the lyrics on one side of the song and then a photo of the member 
so that's quite nice why does Alex Sibido look so weird in that photo? It's like he's like caught off guard. Then more lyrics. I like the whole concept for this album quite a lot actually. I'm not gonna lie. It's quite a nice concept. They did quite a good job. Oh, what do y'all? Murakami. Yokoyama. Oh, this hair was so tragic for him. I feel so bad for him there. More lyrics. Wahaha, wahaha. It's a bop, yo. I love it. Look at that. And then all the other songs here. Oh, this is quite cool. It is like the handwriting of, of course, when the maybe the members did write the songs. The handwriting of the members in the back for the lyrics. That's quite cool. I quite like that idea. It makes it a little more um, personal. Maru. And of course, yes, it is. Wearing his very interesting and colourful clothes, as per usual. And then the last page. And in the back. Awesome, so that was my unboxing right there, guys. So I was quite short. Um, I'm, I'm kind of complaining if I want to do this with all my albums that I've got. Do a little unboxing for you guys, because I think they're quite helpful for people who want to buy these albums. To just see if, you know, if the content's that's in the album really worth buying the album for. But they are quite short, kind of like useless videos. But um, anyway, let me know what you guys thought. Thank you very much for watching this unboxing. Overall, I did quite like this album. Um, as for songs, 10 out of 10, kind of these are the one of my favourite lots of collection songs by them, of course. Um, as for what's in the album, I think maybe a good 7 out of 10. You know, it has a cute making photo book. The whole concept is quite nice and it goes throughout the album. And um, I just thought it was really executed very well. So I just thought overall it's a really good album. And um, if you're a fan of Kanji 28 and you love the songs, I recommend you guys buying it. Anyway, thank you very much for watching my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. Bye.